If you're having trouble connecting your wireless TV to the internet, the problem could lie in the TV itself or your home network. But before you begin troubleshooting either one, let's figure out what the problem is. Are you having trouble connecting all of your devices to the internet or just your TV? Does your TV connect but have trouble loading apps? We've got a different video for each specific issue. There are a few things you'll need to be familiar with. There's the router, that's what connects your computer to your local network. And there's also the modem, that's what connects your router to the internet. In some cases, the router and the modem could be one combo device. Your router has an SSID or Service Set Identifier. That's the name of your wireless network, created by you or whoever set up your network. Your network will also most likely have a password, which will be needed to connect devices to your network. For a strong connection, we recommend placing your router no more than 20 feet from your device, preferably on the same floor, with as few thick walls or dense metal obstructions in between as possible. If you must have your router and TV on different floors, place them as closely together as possible. Also, check the settings on your router. Ensure your router is transmitting in 2.4 GHz, as this frequency has the longest range and is the most widely compatible frequency. If you have a dual-band router and a newer television that supports the 5 GHz frequency, you can try connecting to the 5 GHz network. However, if the connection is weak, we recommend using 2.4 GHz. Take a look at these items in your home and get familiar with them. Then, choose the next video that matches your problem. If you can't connect to the internet on any device, choose No Devices Connecting to the Internet. If it's just your TV that won't connect, choose Cannot Connect TV to the Internet. If you can connect to the internet but are having trouble with an app, choose Trouble Loading Apps on TV.